Hi everyone, welcome to the Noble Strength channel. My name is Audrey and today guys, I just wanna say hello, welcome. I've been away for a minute. I did go out of town last weekend. That's why I did not upload. I went to go visit my mom. I did not do any filming, just wanted to focus on visiting. You know how it is, but I am back. And if you like videos about shopping and finding bargains, then I think you're gonna enjoy this video. This is a eclectic haul of things that I found, bargains and deals that I found over the Labor Day weekend and a little pre-Labor Day and post-Labor Day uh, deals that I found online and offline. So if you're into that type of thing, stick around, like and subscribe and click that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload more videos. I love sharing these type of videos because there are brands out there that are really good quality brands that you might not have heard of. I know that's how I learn about things through watching other content creators and I love that. And so um, I'm gonna be sharing with you some deals that I found at City Trends, Dillard's. Uh, don't have any thrift finds this time because I didn't see anything at the thrift stores in Memphis. So that was a bust. But I did find some things online at Sam Edelman. They were having a huge sale. Um, those things have not arrived yet. So I think I'm gonna do a separate video for these Sam Edelman shoes that I purchased. But I did find some things here locally in Augusta at Surrey Center or Surrey Shoes, which is a kind of a high-end shoe place here. But every year around this time during the change of the season, they have a huge blowout sale where they have up to like 75% off on their shoes. You can't beat that. We're talking about shoes that are normally like a hundred and something dollars. I got it for $30. You guys, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Deals like that. I'm just gonna share with you what I found, but this video is a sponsored video and it's sponsored by New Life Art and Design. Yes, you heard it right. My business, New Life Art and Design, is sponsoring this video. So if you haven't checked out New Life Art and Design, go ahead and check out my website. I have some really cool things on there and I am having a sale right now. I have some really cool designs from my uh, Basquiat Tribute Design. This is the Jean-Michel Basquiat t-shirt. You can get it in all colors and different cuts and styles of tees and they pair well with jeans and slacks. You can really jazz them up. I just think it's a cool graphic. I also have this print We're available on coffee mugs, tote bags. I love this cool tote bag. You can get this tote bag in different sizes. This is the jumbo size and it holds a lot, a lot. It's got really nice, uh, sturdy, canvas straps that are really nicely tightly woven it has a nice lining that is coated so it is kind of like spill proof easy to clean on the inside and it's just a really thick canvas and no pockets or anything on the inside just a nice simple tote but very eye-catching and it's at a really reasonable price and they're on sale right now this bag holds a lot. Like I said, this is the jumbo size. There is a smaller, a medium size, and then a smaller size. This holds my jumbo notepads and sketchbooks and all of my heavyweight art books and utensils, not utensils, but <laughs> tools and things that I use as an artist. It holds all of that. So you look really cute and stylish. And if you don't want to carry art supplies, it carries your everyday items in here. It's just a really cool bag to wear and it's very fashionable. So I have these online on sale as well as the t-shirts, coffee mugs, and other things. So check it out. I also have my upcycled handbags on there. And I will be doing a drop sometime this coming fall because as you know, summer is almost over. Well, that is my plug for New Life Art and Design. Now let's jump into this haul. I hope you're still tuned in. Go ahead and get your beverage. I think you're gonna like this. So let's start out with my Instagram find. You guys, you know when you are a creator, you are a creative type person, you wanna support other creative people. So I find myself shopping on Instagram because this is where you can find some cool, unique items. And I happen to see 
of this content creator who's a fashion blogger wearing this bag and I was just like oh my gosh it's so cool and of course she tagged the person that she purchased it from so I went to their site and purchased a bag now check this bag out guys this is the coolest bag so this bag is by bag junkie bags and you can find her on bag junkie at gmail.com or bag junkie.com and you can find her on instagram at bag junkie i love this bag and she designs shoes jewelry rugs you name it she has the most stylish coolest things so if you want to be different you want to be unique definitely check out her uh, site so this is a nice size kind of clutch bag that also can double as a crossbody as well. So it has this faux snake print, vegan friendly um, material here. And then you have this nice wash denim over here. This is a nice leather branding that she has on her bags and that she puts on her bags, which is really cool. And then this removable eye catching leopard red strap. You know that caught my eye. I love red and I love the contrasting and the mix of the different materials. And it's just a really cool bag. And it's just an open, um, dark interior inside. Uh, no pockets or anything like that. But you do have this outside pocket here, which is nice where you can put something in. And then you do have this adjustable strap. So I picked this bag up. This is a one of a kind. This bag was... Now it's pretty pricey, but I splurge on things that are unique, that are handcrafted, that someone took the time to make. I believe in investing in someone else's skills. And this one uh, was $150. I think it's really cool. It has this nice little uh, tabs on the side where you can remove the uh, straps. You can change out the straps if you wanna mix it up a little bit. You can buy your own straps or you can carry it as a nice little clutch, which I'll do a styling of this, um, how this cute little bag can be styled. It can be styled so many different ways, but definitely check out Bag Junkie uh, bags. But I picked that up over the uh, break. Now let's go to the uh, next items that I picked up, which were shoes. So there's this local place called Surrey Shoes here in Augusta in Surrey Center. And I went by there and all of these shoes that I picked up were $30 even. They were just getting rid of all of their kind of summery type shoes, getting ready for fall. And so I picked up some deals. A couple of them I have already worn and they're super comfortable. So you might be able to find these online. If I can find the links, I'll definitely share them in the description box below so you can check those out. All right, guys, so I learned how to shop from my mom. <laughs> if you know the song, my mama told me, you better shop around. So yeah, she told me how to shop around for a deal. Do not pay retail price for anything. If you don't have to, you can get good quality things by catching those sales, especially at the change of season. Dillard's always has great sales, but right now we're gonna check out the ones that I got at Surrey Center. So this is a brand uh, that you probably heard of, Sorel, very uh, comfortable shoes. This is a, a nice platform type wedge sandal that I picked up in cream. Love, love, love. It has this rubber sole on it. And when I say super comfortable, super cushiony, Love the strapping on here. Nice, supple leather strapping. And I got so many compliments on these when I wore them to school. You know, people saying they look comfortable. And with me being an art teacher on my feet all day, these were perfect. And they came in other colors. They came in a tan and black. And, you know, I'm always getting black. But they didn't have the black in my size. So that's why I didn't get the black ones. But I did pick up these and I... I did practice some temperance and self-control because they also had um, this in a tan in my size, but I didn't get them even though I was tempted to. I was like, you know, Audrey, you don't need this. That's excessive. So I just picked up this pair and they're really, really cute. So I got um, these and these were $30. Like I said, everything was $30. I've already worn them. That's what they look like on the bottom. 
uh, but really great deal. So check out those high-end places where you live locally at this time of the year because you never know. You could get 75, 80% off on things. Okay, so the next item that I picked up was from All Black brand, which I've never heard of before. So if you've heard of the brand All Black, let me know in the comments below. But that was my first time hearing. And um, by the way, talk about savings. I saved over 300 and something dollars uh, in savings at the end because she gave me the little uh, receipt and said, this is what you saved. Over 300 and something dollars. Like I said, these were all like pricey shoes. Um, this was retailed at $195. I got them for 30. And these are just some cute little slip-on wedge sandals with the studding on them. These I have not worn, but I just thought they were really cute. And since I wear a lot of black, I have those handy for uh, next year. I still have some time where I can wear them now, which I probably will, but I picked those up. All right, next, Dolce Vita. Now, Dolce Vita is a pretty well-known brand. You can find this these uh, this brand at DSW. These were priced at $175, but once again, I got them for $30. And a really good deal on these sneakers. I picked these up because, and I've worn them um, because of the kind of neutral color with the pop of color in the back. I thought that was unique. And I just like that kind of um, quilting material here. And then the suede around the edges, you have that light kind of lavender there and against that tan. And I just thought they were really cool. So I picked these up. Nice to wear with your denim. And those are all the shoes that I picked up from Surrey Center. And like I say, these were $30 and a really great deal. Okay, now we're gonna keep moving to the shoes that I picked up at Dillard's. All right, so the shoes that I picked up from Dillard's, really great deal on all of these. These are some Michael Kors sandals. These are in black, and you guys, I just thought they were too cute. They took me back. Remember, we used to call them shackles back in the 80s, and are kind of gladiator type shoes, but I just love them. They're just a simple black with the uh, gold detailing there, and they're super comfortable. I picked these up for under $40. These were $38, so really, really nice deal. They were originally $109, so Dillard's really has great end of the season sale, so I picked these little cuties up. All right, now, Moving right along, these reminded me of some Chanel shoes without the C's, so I don't have to pay the price that comes along with having the interlocking C's. These are some Steve Maddens, and these are just some cute uh, ballerina slippers with the toe cap on it, the two-tone, so you have that neutral color against the black with the little bow detailing. Like I say, very similar to the Chanel shoes that you would pay probably thousands of dollars for. And I paid $31 for these. And I have been racking up on shoes only because I haven't really been purchasing a whole lot of shoes lately. And now that I'm teaching again, I want shoes that are comfortable and I wanna have things that I can change out. Uh, throughout the year and so I did pick up these cuties right here really great deal so definitely check out dealers because I think the sales are still going on right now guys and moving right along I picked up these uh Deltan shoes and I first learned about Deltan through thrift shopping I found some shoes that were really high quality that were ballerina slippers love them looked them up and found that they are a dealer's brand so I picked these cuties up. I um, haven't even unwrapped the bow off of them on this one, but on the one that I tried on, I did. So it has this cute little bow detailing. Let me put that to the side. Here, that is too cute. And the heel is not too high. This is like a three inch heel, 
I believe, which is a nice heel height for me. There's some cushioning there, but I love a wraparound ankle strap shoe, sandal, and these are my kind of like go-to dressy sandal type shoe to wear. And I like that they are leather bottom uh, and leather uh, insole as well as leather top. So really nice, high quality shoe. Check out Delton shoes. Okay, and I like them so much that I picked them up in a neutral color gold. Metallic is really in this year, guys. You know, with the silver being in, and I got these gold ones, just like the black ones with the cute little bow. And uh, they look so cute on, like I'm showing you on the side. And like I said, I just like that they're an all leather shoe, including the sole, which they wear well over time when you have that leather sole. So I got those. And these were, did I say the prices on these guys? I don't think I did. $27 for both pair of these uh, sandals. So those are all the um, non-clothing items that I got. Now I'm gonna show you what I picked up from City Trends. Hey guys, yes, this is the same day, but it's later in the day. I'm interjecting this into the filming because I realized I forgot to share with you something else that I purchased over the Labor Day weekend, but it had nothing to do with Labor Day sales. They were already good deals on Amazon. And that is these chains. I was looking for some new chains uh, to accessorize my bags with. And I had recently purchased this bag back in June. Um, this is a crochet bag by Hooked by Lade. The designer is Lade and the company is Hooked by Lade. And she hand crochets all these bags. But this bag came with a chunky kind of plastic uh, chain and I was wanting something that was a little bit heavier weight that was also metal so I found this Cuban link uh, metal chain that has the circular rings that you can kind of attach it to on the sides here and I also found this this is a plastic uh, kind of loose site uh, tortoise shell link chain link with the goals and I found this and I got these for a really great deal I think I paid uh, different prices for each one and so I'll leave them in the description box below But I just thought they were really cool They don't hang as long as the original chain that came with the bag and I like that and I like that you can layer the bag uh, layer the links and I also picked up the smaller uh, Cuban chain link here that you can attach to your different bags and accessorize and so I can hook all three of them on here actually the more layers the better right <laughs> but there's so many different ways that you can create the look so you can have the really multi-layered look or you can wear them singular um, I'm just gonna do a cutaway so you can see the different ways that you can uh, do the chain links, but I just think they are adorable. So I picked those up and I thought they were really good deals. I'm gonna leave them in my Amazon affiliate link in the description box below. So yes, I'm an Amazon affiliate. When you use the links that are in my description box, I do get a little bit of a profit from that. So it helps me out. So if you're looking for any chains, use those links. And I absolutely love, love, love these. Like I said, you can interchange them and a lot of things that you can interchange. So real, real quick, let me show you. They're just so super easy to hook, unhook and all of that. So I'm gonna take the smaller one off because I can put these on so many different bags. That's what I love about uh, accessories. So this bag that I just recently showed you that I got, I could hook it on the side here um, and have it hooked on. So let's do that real quick. And I just think it's the coolest thing. I love chains. I don't know what it is about gold chains that I really, really like. They just elevate things to me. They just make things look better, more uh, sophisticated, more rich, if you will, more luxe if you will. So here is that chain on this bag that I got by Bag uh, Junkie. 
and just really, really cute. So I just wanted to share that with you real quick. Now back to the clothes that I got from City Trends. So next I picked up two pair of jeans um, from City Trends and these are brands that I've never heard of before. This is what is called U uh, Unia. Uh, Unia, Unina, Unina is what they're called. Uh, denim, uh, they specialize in denim jeans and they're a wholesale denim wholesaler and a lot of different stores buy this brand wholesale and sell in their stores. So you can probably find this in a lot of different stores, this brand. But I just thought these were a nice feel of denim. They just have a nice quality feel and they're different. I like a button fly and these are cropped with the kind of rubbed edges, which I think would look really good with a crisp white shirt. So I picked those up or either denim on denim that would look good. And so I also picked up these uh, cello, I believe that's how you pronounce it, cello jeans, which is also another whole denim wholesaler, denim jeans wholesaler, and you can find them online as well. In order to buy and shop from them, you have to be a member, and I think you buy in bulk. But like I say, stores buy uh, this brand and sell them in their store. So you can find this brand in boutiques and things like that. And I like the kind of asymmetrical slanted button fly and these are a wide leg. And these are, both of these are junior sizes. So they're fitting a little tighter on me than uh, they're probably meant to fit, but I like the way they fit me. So I went ahead and picked them up. So I got those. And then the last thing that I picked up from City Trans is a closet essential that I think everybody should have in their closet. And that, my dear, is a crisp white shirt. Just a crisp white plain shirt, nothing special about it. This brand is Riley and James, which I've never heard of, but I'm gonna pair them with my jeans and my new uh, bag junkie uh, bag so that's what I picked up guys and now I'm about to do the styling and then that will be it much for tuning in for this eclectic haul. I just like sharing deals that I got. This is all the things that I have received thus far from my splurge, my shopping splurge. I might as well just call it that because I went just kind of ballistic, I guess. So this coming um, November, I'm going to do a no buy. For the month of November, I am doing a no buy. And I am just going to save, save, save because I have spent my share within the last three weeks to last the entire year. I have things that I've purchased that have not even come yet, which I will do a separate video on. That is my Sam Edelman shoe haul. But I think I'm good for the year now, guys. I think I am set until at least, um, hmm, I don't know, when December, at the end of December or January, when they start having those sales again. But anyway, that is it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and I will be coming back real, real soon. I love you guys. And remember to be a good steward of all that God has given you because he loves us so much. Bye.